For my ethics case, I have chosen to do case five, theft of services. In this ethical case, a student has given out a password to another student that is the password to a computer class at the school they attend and go to. Probably in this case, this other student is one of his friends, but we don't really know that. Normally, in order to be enrolled in this class, you have to pay in order to take it and with the payment comes a password that is given to you. However, that password is not to be passed around to other students. Instead of following the school's policy, the student who received the password takes advantage of the school computers by using it for three hours in a time-sharing environment. This, in itself, causes an ethical issue not only in the school area, but also in the workplace. Ethical issues in the workplace are very hard to put a nail to. There are many obstacles to go around in order to come up with the right answer. In most cases, there really is no right answer. In the ethics module, it talks about how ethical issues are normally tied into religious beliefs. However, if they were only tied into religious beliefs, that would mean that these ethical issues were only tied to religious people. That, in this sense, in this case, is not the case. Ethical issues are to be applied to all sorts of people and should always be debated until you find the right answer. In this case, we have a student that we don't know much about. He seemed to have only used the computer time for three hours and that's it. However, is that ethical? We don't know. It is hard to say. Since we don't know much about him, it is hard to come up with a right answer. Say that this student was only trying to get this password because he was late on an assignment and needed to finish it. In that case, it wouldn't be ethical because one, it is his fault for not completing his or her assignment on time, and two, he did not purchase it himself, which is against the school rules. However, what if this student that we know nothing about currently had serious money issues at home and couldn't afford a computer and could only complete this assignment if one of his friends lent it him a password to the school computers. In that case, I personally would say his friend did the ethical thing by lending him the password. It's hard to say what I would personally do because I don't know the background of the student being talked about in this case five. If it were the money situation, I would have given him the password. However, if it is a case in which he just wanted to take advantage of the computers and break the school rules, I would probably address the situation to the principal of the school and see if any repercussions can be made.